I'm just putting the probe in the area of decay just above where the limb fell I'm pushing it in and it has gone in that far into decayed timber this indicates a significant weakness with the internal structure of the tree this means that this problem will, will not heal so we are we're left with a tree that is at a significant risk to the users of the common I will borrow I've now gone above the, the cavity where the limb fell where a bracket fungus is starting to grow that the area of decay has extended above the cavity this timber here should be solid and very hard not spongy and breaking away as it is finally this screwdriver I shall now um, push into the heartwood of the tree and you can see that it virtually disappeared. Therefore we shall now cut the tree down. This tree is approximately 130 years old um, and is, is reaching the end of its safe life. Um, as you can see here, this is the cavity um, that we were looking at earlier. The tree has snapped at that point, which indicates how weak it is. You will see the cambium, which is the, the bright white wood. So you have the live wood on the outside and then the heartwood in the centre of the tree. And this is, this is actually dead timber, but it, it's what gives the tree its strength and it will hold the tree up. However, in this case, the, the heartwood has decayed to such an extent that it is now very, very weak. And that explains why it snapped at this point when the tree fell over. And for a tree of this size to snap in this way is most unusual and it gives a very clear indication of the fragility and the condition of these trees which of this particular tree um, which is in a very very poor state and th that is the reason why we've taken it down today. This is where the tree was cut where we did the cheese cut just here that's the cut that controls the direction of fall and you will see clearly here the extent of the decay timber this line here clearly marks where the tree has tried to contain the spread of the decaying wood a, 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 a very very clear line all the way around and that is the difference between the, the, the live good wood on the outside and the hot wood that is beginning to rot and decay and, you, and you can see here that the, that the heartwood is becoming very crumbly and weak um, and even more so on this side and it actually turns into um, 
basically it's, it's just like wet balsa wood and has no strength at all. And once we discover this um, on a, in a tree of this age, then we have to we have to do something about it.